You guys ready? Yeah. 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 Let's do it. Hey, everybody. We are from the Silk Road Ensemble, which is a group of musicians that represent a lot of different cultures from different countries all over the world. And we show how many similarities there are between different cultures, how every culture has a folk tradition and every culture has a classical tradition of some kind. And so we're each gonna talk a little bit about our instruments and where we come from. Great, yeah. Um, my name is uh, Ko Umezaki. Uh, it's Umezaki Kojiro in Japan. And I play this instrument called the Shakuachi. Uh, which is a bamboo flute. It has the root end of the bamboo right here, which is really, really tough to get out of the ground. And then you have five finger holes, one, two, three, four, and then one back here. Um, let me give you a taste of, or a little bit of a, uh, a hearing of what the uh, sound of this instrument might be. Think bamboo grove that is old and it's wind blowing through it. <laughs> What does great. your instrument sound like? Who are you? I know you're, you're kind of a lot of air sound, yeah. but I don't have. So I, I'm woman, and uh, this is a Chinese instrument. It's called Pi Pa, and uh, with the four strings, and you use a finger to pluck. It's so very much like a banjo, right here. <laughs> and uh, uh, pipa is a very old Chinese instrument, existing in China about 2,000 years old. It's like very, very old probably older than banjo. So sound like this. And if you, you may, I don't think you can see this, but on her hand, she's got picks. Yeah, I got very special, like a plastic picks on five fingers. So this is a very kind of a modern way to play the instrument. In old days, we just use natural fingernails, just like a banjo, we play just that. Because we change this, um, the string um, from a silk string, now it's a metal string, so much louder sound, so that's why use this plastic fingernails. So I have a banjo, but it's not a banjo that you may represent, that may represent a banjo to you guys, because this is an old style banjo. This is a replica from 1858, and it's a much lower sound than the really bright sound of the modern banjo. And I don't play with picks, although bluegrass musicians play with picks and they, and they pluck like this. I play a very old style called claw hammer. The banjo is actually an African American instrument that was invented in the Caribbean and the claw hammer style that I'm going to show you in just a second goes all the way back to West Africa and some of the big lute instruments that came before the banjo. <laughs>
Wow. Oh my god, that was so cool. <laughs> First oh time ever, I think, this combination, right? <laughs> of it's so yeah. Cool. Yeah. This awesome. is from Japan, this is from China, mm -hmm. this is from Caribbean via yeah. West Africa. And here you see how the languages that we each speak, which they're different musical languages, we can find a common you know, a common thread to those languages and speak to each other musically, which is why music is so important, which is why it's so important to talk about all the different kinds of musics there are, because it's a way that we can figure out how do we talk to each other? This is what we're doing with our voices, but it's a, it's a, a really fun way to see how we can do that with each other. So thanks for listening. Thank you.